Hi and welcome to Chuck's channel. I'm fixing my Ender 3 and it's got a wobble. So now I'm taking the bed leveling screws off and you've got to be careful that once you've got them off that the springs don't come off. Now the back ones are a bit harder than the front ones to undo. I'm really concentrating here, I reckon. So the last one's coming off now. Now, something I didn't really think about, I need to lift the Z axis up. So right now, I'm trying to put the springs on the table. And then I've realized, oh shit, I've got to lift this body thing. So I've just got to lift it up. Sorry if anyone was offended by the word shit. I shouldn't say that. Anyway. Now I'm pointing out the the wheel. Wheels on that are in the aluminium tracks. I'm going to try and tighten the system up. But as you'll find out in a little while, this wasn't the problem. So even if you tighten it as much as you can and you're finding that it's not really fixing it, it's doing a little bit, but it's not really fixing it, then we'll have to go to the next bit. By the way, while we're here, please subscribe and please like if you can. I'd also like to say to all my friends that are up in towns away, stay dry. They've gotten uh, around about 370 mils. It's a lot of rain. But, um, yeah. So now I've got it off. Um, you notice that the build plate, you've got to be careful with not to bend your heat bed cables which I haven't so I'm undoing it using a 8 mil uh, spanner which isn't the best thing to do so I suggest grabbing yourself an 8 mil socket and grabbing the right hex key that would have come with the kit and undoing these I'm still trying to tighten it up, of course, trying to get it to work. This isn't the problem, of course. The problem, and this will quickly speed up things for people that want to just shoot on through and get some work done themselves. The problem is that at the factory, one of the uh, alignment nuts I caught, or wash, uh, more of a um, alignment spacer, it has got nuts on it, um, was put in upside down. So it makes the whole bed wobble and nothing really works properly. So to fix it, you need to pull apart the right hand side, in this case, the right hand side um, wheels. So see how I've pulled the wheel apart there? If you have a look, there's a little thin bit the thick bit has to go up the top bit, not the thin bit. I discuss it. Now, the actual nut on that wheel is 10 mil. So if you need to undo that, that's 10 mil. So that's it. So you've got 8 mil for the, the nut and 10 mil for the spacer come nut come adjustment because it's got a cam on it and it locks in the actual bed to the Z, to the uh, correction, the Y axis. So we're putting it back together again. We get it all back together again and that'll be it. So if you like this video, please subscribe, please like, please leave comments, love looking at comments. Um, 
This is the first time I've used a different system to try and record. I'm trying to speed it up for you guys. I don't think it's worth sitting there. Um, I'm a bit slower on all my work at the moment because I'm running out of a bit of cash and I don't want to uh, try and take the money off other people. Just showing off the nuts and that's it.